Good afternoon YouTube, Bree here. It's Sunday afternoon. Um, the 20th of March 2016. Um, yeah, you might be wondering what that is. It looks like a jet ski, doesn't it? Well, it's not. <laughs> it's the boat turned upside down. Um, why has it got blue marks all over it? Blue ringed octopus? No. Um, I've just gone around and just marked out the faults um, there's a couple of scratches there that's got to be re redone for the um, the anchor chain uh, or rope uh, there's a couple of marks there looks like it's been filled there um, which is normal for them um, along the bottom you get all the, the little scrapes uh, where they've come up along rocks and that um, there's a little one there that's got silicon on it. That's that's got to come off and get re fiberglassed. A little mark there that's going to be fixed. We've got one here that I was telling you about the other day, crow's feet. You can actually see it now. Um, but yeah, there's another one there beside it. Just you won't be able to see it when it's got the big coat of paint on it. Um, but like the main the main part of the the hole comes along where it's been knocked around a bit it's got a lot of um, a lot of um, body filler on it not fiberglass they've actually done it with body filler uh, so I'm actually going to come along and fix all that reshape it um, yeah I'm going to come around the back the, Great big uh, transom still uh, hasn't been done yet, um, but yeah, this see like that. Look, that just came off. Hasn't been um, sanded back properly for anything to stick to, and I've just peeled it by hand. Um, it's a thin layer of fiberglass. Uh, it's supposed to be eight layers. That's hardly to be anywhere near eight layers. So I'm gonna start start on the base of it. Um, make sure it's all nice and watertight. I was speaking to uh, Sunny J, and uh, not so. There goes again. Another big piece. Um, speaking to Sunny J about this, and where the uh, the outboard sits. Damn shame it's not big enough to put it inboard. Uh, big Chevy. Um, it goes about this section here where it's flat. Um, I'm thinking about actually getting some 10, 20, 20 mil um, tubular. Might be steel. I'll come along the, along the base of that. Pop rivet that to the actual steel. And then I might go up and I might get Sonny J to do a couple of bit of welding with some um, uh, cyclone fencing. Um, oh yeah, they like the, the square fencing that they have out the front of uh, um, schools and that, like mesh and that. Well, I have mesh anyway. Um, and then I'll fiberglass it up from there. Um, it's only just to basically hold the motor. Um, I don't think I need that much um, marine ply. It's just, yeah, it's only it's only at the back of the boat anyway. Um, and this this was the last model before they went to full fiberglass anyway. So maybe I can do a bit of a alteration and then change it. So we'll see how we go. That's why I've left pretty much that even square. And um, I'll just take my time at it. This isn't a rush job, of course. Uh, I've got a couple of bets. <laughs> well, I haven't got bets. Um, a couple of the others have got bets to see how quick I can actually get this up and running and on, and on the water. Um, you know who you are. 
Steve Punk. <laughs> um, but anyway, yeah. So anyway, I'm gonna flip the phone around and I might do a short video and you can actually see my face for a change. Might be long. <laughs>